Hardy and Yefimova have won the title the last four world championships, but Ruta Melutita of Lithuania, the world record holder. Pink cap, middle of the pool. Watch Melutita start. Boom, she gets off the block so well. Point six two, not quite as quick as she was in the semifinals, and the rest of the swimmers are really good as well, so that could hurt her. Atkinson right there in front of you is my dark horse in this. She's got a lot of front half speed. Oh, yeah, Atkinson from Jamaica is second from the bottom and looking pretty good. Melutite up there in lane four trying to hold off yep. Fima Babalora in lane five, and here comes the Russian who's here in front of the crowd, and there goes Atkinson in lane seven. There are five swimmers that crash to the wall, and it's Johansson of Sweden. Jenny Johansson of Sweden who out-touches them all. Atkinson with the silver, and it was Yefimova who got the bronze. They were all neck and neck as they came into the wall. You never take the 50 for granted. Ever, ever, ever take a 50 for granted. Anything can happen. I was going to say before the race, it was the difference between the haves and have-nots. Not this one, a second separated. You can see Melatita had that great start, but not as quick as she's been in the past. And that gave hope to everybody else. And then you were right, Dan, right here. You tell me when they come in, who wins that 15 one hundredths of a second separates the top five swimmers there. But in the end, it was Johansson by six one hundredths of a second over Atkinson right underneath her. Unbelievable race. And then it's like, you just can't believe it. Did that just happen? Johansson took seventh in the hundred. Two-time finalist at the Worlds in this event and finally breaks through. And an electric final. Atkinson, second career medal. Actually, Johansson picks up the first ever medal in a breaststroke event for Sweden. So history for Johansson with a beautiful touch as we go underneath the water again to show you how close it was.